What's up everybody, welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good morning and uh, welcome to this scheduled analysis on Cardano. Um, if you don't know me, but most of you probably do, um, basically I've created a schedule with all of the big cryptos I cover every day. So Monday till Sunday, it's in the Discord if you want to check that out. I could also post it in the description, let me know. Uh, but it's still new to me, but Cardano was uh, was on the schedule for today. So it's actually it's it, it's actually pretty relaxing because I don't have to worry about what to what to analyze. But in this video, we'll, we'll cover Cardano. Um, and if you don't know me, basically what we'll do is, is we'll take a look at the price. We'll also take a look at some of the news around it. There's some, some minor news around the Charles Hoskinson, obviously one of the founders of Cardano. Maybe he was the only founder, not sure. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll talk about we'll talk about that a little bit, and then we'll talk about the price because Cardano has fallen significantly, and I want you to guess at at what low point we are right now, right? I mean, uh, I want you to guess when the last time was that we hit these levels. I'll tell you, I'll tell you, it was uh, January two thousand and twenty one, uh, two thousand and twenty, I believe. No, two thousand twenty one. Excuse <laughs> excuse me. Um, but yeah, so a long time ago, almost uh, like more than one and a half years ago, um, Cardano has been very bearish over the last months even. As you can see, we've just been in this continued downtrend. Uh, volume has been really low, even though we got that Fazil hard fork uh, end of September, which I thought was very bullish for Cardano. Um, we have been we have been suffering, all right? Uh, volume right now, e even right now, when, when we're at relatively low levels, um, it's at 3.5%. Usually what you see is that if, if a crypto drops down to significantly low levels that the volume increases to, to actually get up a, a little bit again. Um, so yeah, it's, it, I don't think it's looking too great. Uh, tomorrow we'll have some inflation rate numbers. So hopefully those will be good for Cardano. Uh, but for now, what you can see what happened is that we got that bearish breakout out of 41 and a half cents, dropped down immediately under 40 cents. Uh, so now we're kind of stuck between 38 that's that's like a, I mean this is a massive key area but 38 is one within that um, we're stuck between 38 and 40 cents what I expect ahead of tomorrow because tomorrow we'll have inflation rate numbers from the US as I said and that's going to make the market move all right so ahead of tomorrow I, I do expect a little bit more bullish momentum something like this uh, so it's it's obviously one day and like five hours until that news event so there's only limited possible movements uh, but I think we'll, we'll get up to 40 cents, find resistance and maybe start getting above 40 cents. I, I do think that's possible. But then the, the news event hits and I'll, tomorrow I'll make a, a full video on what that means for all cryptos. Uh, but for Cardano specifically, I think that would uh, that could be pretty devastating. Uh, because I think that if it's actually higher than expected, then I think we, we could drop down all the way to 37 and 36 cents. All right, so another quite a big drop. Um, if, if, if it's bullish though, so if it's lower than expected, that's good for the economy, that's good for the upcoming interest rate decision, uh, then I think Cardano could, could get all the way up to 42 cents immediately and have, have quite a big chance of breaking above that too. Um, all right, so, so just in, in general, tomorrow, as I said, I'll make a full video on, on what it means for all cryptos. I'm not sure if I'll make a full video on Cardano for it, uh, but this is, this is kind of what, what you can expect because I think tomorrow will kind of be at the same price area of, of where we are right now. Lower than expected inflation rate is uh, bullish. We'll get up to 42 cents at least. Um, higher than expected is very bearish. Then we'll, we'll drop down further and I don't think 38 cents could, uh, could, could, could hold us. Um, so yeah, and, and all together, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll be back with another Cardano update, I think in the weekend. I'm not sure what the schedule is uh, at the, from, from the top of my head yet. Um, but there I'll, I'll talk a little bit more about what I expect in, in the upcoming months for Cardano. Uh, but for now, that's my update today. So if you do have any questions about it, let me know down in the comments. But for now, I'd like to thank you all for watching and listening. And I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.